What's up everyone? My name is Kelly and welcome to part four of my fall decorate with me series. If you guys miss parts one, two, or three, I'll make sure to link those below. Today we're going to be decorating my entryway. If you guys watch any of my other fall decorate with me videos, you'll know that I'm sticking with a more neutral vibe this season, but adding in like rich muted tones such as coppers and golds. I want to add different textures like baskets and wood, different metals, some natural elements, as well as faux florals. And I'll also be mixing in some knit blankets and cozy throw pillows. Here's our entryway. I'm working with a clean slate. I'm going to show you guys everything that we're going to use for this space today to keep the decor simple yet warm and inviting. Per usual, I have everything thrown on my dining room table that we're going to decorate with. So I'm going to start at this end and just work my way around. I'm going to be using this knit throw blanket that I got from Target last year. This is by Threshold. I have this cream and orange plaid throw blanket. This one is from the Target dollar spot. Here is a lumbar pillow that I found at Target on clearance. I'm also going to be using these two throw pillows. This one I recently found at Hobby Lobby. This one is reversible. So this side has like a beigey kind of linen material. And then the other side has a really pretty caramel color with like a quilted velvety material. And it also has a removable cover. And then this pillow is a Walmart find. I found this a few months ago. This one is also reversible, but I'm going to be using this side with the thinner stripes. What's up, buddy? Are you following me around? This guy's my shadow. I have this metal bucket that I found at a local home store, and then I just threw in a bunch of faux greenery. I'm also going to be using this gold lantern that I found at Hobby Lobby, along with two flameless candles and this cinnamon scented potpourri. I'm also going to be using this basket. I'm pretty sure I use this for every season and every holiday. And here is that floor vase that I found at Kirkland's. You can see this in my fall haul video. And then I just have it filled with some faux florals from Hobby Lobby. I'm also going to be using this basket filled with a few wood pumpkins. This pumpkin I found at Home Goods yesterday. This one was $15 and I just love the textured look of this one. It actually matches perfectly with the pumpkins that I found in the Target dollar spot this year. This is just carpet tape that I ordered from Amazon. I'm going to be using it on the area rug that I had by our front door. I'm just going to move this over in front of the bench. I'm going to be using a few of my favorite leaf stems that I found at Hobby Lobby this year, along with a few colorful stems that I used in my home last year. Here is the pumpkin patch sign that I ordered from Etsy. Um, I showed this in my fall haul video. I just stuck it in a frame that I had from Target. Honestly, I feel like it's a little too small for the space that I want to put it in. I know one of you guys are going to point that out and I totally agree with you. I wish it was a little bit larger, but I still love the print and I'm still going to hang it up. And the last two items we're going to use are these stools. This top one, that one is from Hobby Lobby. And then the one on the bottom, I thrifted from the Salvation Army. All right, guys, grab your coffee, whether it's hot or iced. Today, I'm drinking the Apple Crisp Macchiato and let's start decorating.
All right, guys, well, that's gonna be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed decorating my entryway with me and got some great ideas for your own home. Next week, we're gonna be in Disneyland for their annual Halloween party, so stay tuned for some of that footage. I'm gonna try my best to put together a video for you guys so you can see a little bit of our Halloween trip. Once we're home from our trip, we're gonna start decorating for Halloween, so stay tuned for those upcoming videos. I'll see you all in the next one.